checking your vice alignment. So in this case here, again, handle jog, 10 thousandths in Z, and I bring the tool down, I bring the indicator down just inside the vise. Now, the part that I'm trying to indicate is this section of the vise right here. So above the bolts and below where this vise has been machined. So there's a nice straight section right in here that I want to go ahead and indicate. Some vice, some vices will not have this machining and therefore you can use the top edge of the vice jaw in order to indicate your part. But make sure that you indicate along the entire length of the vice jaw. So I'm going to bring the indicator down. I am then changing to Y and I'm bringing the indicator to about an eighth of an inch away from the vise. Now I change my increment to one thousandths and this is where I make my final approach between the indicator and the vise jaw. You don't need to move the indicator a lot. Again, about five thousandths is about all you need. Now I'm going to go ahead and hit X and ten thousandths and I'm going to move the indicator towards the left side of the vice jaw. And what I'm checking is the difference between the right hand side of the vice and the left hand side of the vice. We want the two of those numbers to be reasonably the same amount. Now we're using a five ten thousandths indicator here. So basically one separation on this indicator is five ten thousandths of an inch. If you get it within five ten thousandths of an inch, that is fine. Once you're done, go ahead and hit the Z, hit ten thousandths, move the handle jog hand wheel clockwise, and move the indicator away from the vise.